Now your storm track weather with meteorologist Gabriela Gomez. We're off to another chilly start this morning. Improvements from yesterday. We're not in the 30s, we're in the 40s. Closer to average for this time of year, but we do heat things up above average later this afternoon. We stayed in the 60s yesterday. Today could be making a run for 80 degrees. We have quite a few temperature swings out ahead of us. Warm today, cooler tomorrow. Then we'll warm back up into the middle part of the week and cool back down by the end. So lots of ups and downs as we anticipate a cold front Thursday that'll bring in a couple chances for rain really off and on and not something that everyone is expected to see. This morning we're running about 5 to 10 degrees warmer than just 24 hours ago. Yesterday we were running about 15 degrees colder than Friday morning. So we're just continuing on with these ups and downs. Clear and quiet this morning from Emporia to Topeka. Really not too bad to start off our Sunday. 45 right now, average low usually upper 40s. So we're not too far off from that. Winds are calm and should stay light for the next few hours. We may get them to pick up later this afternoon. 45 in Burlington, same for Manhattan. Emporia just shy of 50. Concordia holding on to 51. Same for Sabetha this morning. We're going to heat things up most in the upper 70s, but a few spots definitely could get into some low 80s later on this afternoon. We'll hold on to sunshine though. Those winds should stay on the somewhat lighter side, but still a nice little breeze there. These were our highs yesterday, low to mid 60s for pretty much the entire area. It felt great out there. Today is going to be a little bit warmer as we wrap up the weekend. Winds will be a cooler breeze from the northwest, 10 to 15 miles an hour for most of the area. Still going to warm up though. It's not going to stop us from doing so. Winds light through the night and should stay on that lighter side tomorrow as we cool things back down for the start of the week. Overnight lows stay pretty consistent. We'll get back into some 40s tomorrow morning through the afternoon. May stay in those upper 60s. Some spots getting close to 70. Still going to be chilly early Tuesday. We really don't see a big change in overnight lows, but it's going to be those afternoon highs that kind of go back and forth. Tuesday afternoon, some middle, maybe upper 70s. And by the time we get to Wednesday, could be back close to 80 degrees. Then we see our front movement heading towards the second half of the week. Clear and quiet out there this morning. There's some cloud cover just to our north and east there. Really not going to see a whole lot going on. You can see this giant ridge building just to our west there. It's going to sit over us for these next couple of days. Keep us dry till we get to the middle part of the week. Tuesday, I think we could see an isolated shower. Really, we're going to stay dry. Wednesday is probably our better chance to see a few showers off and on throughout the day. None of these look to be complete washouts are going to be hit or miss. Thursday, a lot of the rain was once hitting us. Now models are backing off and pushing it a little bit further northward. Still a chance we could have a few showers Thursday, but may see a better chance for some rain early Friday and maybe a stray shower or two heading into very early Saturday. So very hit or miss. None of it looks super promising to give us at least not rainfall we desperately need, but some 60s tomorrow. Warming back up close to 80 by midweek, and then we cool back down heading towards next weekend. Quite a bit at that. May see some upper 70s Thursday, but with that stronger front that'll move in by that point, we should see temperatures even cooler than where we ended up this past couple of days. May even be struggling out of those upper 50s heading on into next weekend. Man, yin and yang between yesterday and today weather-wise, Gabby. Yeah. Oh my goodness, that difference is crazy. These temperature swings are going to be uh, yeah. fun. Oh man, <laughs> just mentally set in that every now and then we're just going to be back in you know July of 2023. Yeah. And then uh, your, your mind will be a little bit better there, I didn't I turn the heat on yesterday. I haven't caved yet. Usually, I'm, always, caved. I'm usually always early to kind of flip oh, the switch. Yeah. But I feel like you can't because it's going to get warm, you know? Exactly, yeah. And then you'll be mad at yourself yeah. when it's it's hot inside and out. So I'll, you I'll can't just keep win. it cold and I'll just yeah. bundle up and we'll be okay. There we go. We will make it through. We'll eventually get to a, a consistent fall <laughs> one of these yeah. days. It, it'll get here, you know. There we go. Well, hey. <laughs>